What's going on my fan band? What's going on my two squad? So here we are. We have another setup for some homemade cooking. Uh, we're gonna do something a little different today. Um, have y'all ever had a tater tot casserole? That's what we are having today. A tater tot casserole. Let's just hope that don't fall. Okay, so I got my garlic bread y'all. But I wanted to show you the little, um, the tater tot casserole that we have going on. Boom! Y'all seen this before? Y'all see this? Look at that. So essentially, guys, it is, it's still warm, oh, it's hot. Uh, tater tots, lining up the Pyrex pan here. And of course we have some ground beef in there, some cheese and some fried onions on top and some cream of mushroom. So it's very, very simple recipe, guys. It's kind of like, just kind of dump it all in there and do the dang thing. So, ooh. luckily it cooled down a little bit. Oh, it's hot, Never mind. I lied. <laughs> So I'm just going to scoop me up a little bit here so y'all can kind of see what it looked like. Ooh, ooh, it's falling apart, Lord Jesus. There it is. Come on, Jesus. Yes. Ooh. Hopefully y'all can see that mess. Oh, y'all see this? Y'all see how... Oh, there it goes. Where the cheese at? Hmm. The cheese ain't even melted. What is going on? Y'all see this? I wish there was a more color in here, but essentially this is what it is, guys. So you have the tater tots on the bottom. You have some cheese, some ground beef, cream of mushroom on top, and some fried onions. So simple. The simplest thing you can make. All you gotta do is brown the ground beef. Ooh. Look at that. How y'all like this angle? I'm a lot closer to y'all. Please don't fall. No, Jesus, please don't fall. <laughs> I'm messing up already. I'm trying to find the right angle. Look at this. Dropping stuff. Mm. This is so good. So, so easy to make, guys. It's a tater tot casserole. So, you line your pan up with some tater tots, right? Put some cheese on top of that. Whatever cheese you like. We like cheddar cheese um, with this one. Line some brown ground beef on top and um, some cream of mushroom on top of that and some fried onions. Got yourself a meal, y'all. 350 degrees, 45 minutes in the oven. Um, normally you don't season the ground beef because everything else is already salted and seasoned. Mmm. Mmm, so good. So you don't really need to season it, but the hubs actually used adobo seasoning. So if y'all know about adobo seasoning, who knows about that Goya? I know Raf Kitchen knows about some Goya. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm just dropping stuff. Oh my God, he slid all across my tablet, y'all. All the cream is all over the tablet. <laughs> Um, I know Ref Kitchen knows about some Goya products. I know. Who else would know about some Goya products? Oh, yeah, Uno Poco Loco is going to know about some Goya products. Who else knows about some Goya products? So, you put a little adobo seasoning in the ground beef and a little. Did you put black pepper in? No black pepper, y'all. But uh, you don't have to put too, many, too much salt. It's already pretty. Everything else is seasoned already. So, mmm. Quick and easy dinner. And as you can see, that's all laid out. Oh, look at it. Messing up. Messing up. Messing up over there. <laughs> oh, we have to lift this up because it's showing some of the background back here. All right. Oh, my God. Y'all, I can't. We can get this right today. Jesus. We can't get it right. Get the setup, can't. We can't even get the setup right. Half of my head is chopped off, <laughs> but it is good. You guys like tater tots? Basically, it's potato, meat and potatoes, y'all. Meat and potatoes. I should have showed y'all the cooking portion of how we did it. Make it easy. 
Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so yummy. Hopefully y'all is ready for Thanksgiving. Am I releasing this before Thanksgiving? Maybe after. I'm all kinds of mess, y'all. All kinds of mess. I got this plate tilting, y'all. That's why I don't feel confident. I feel like it's going to fall. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, I'm swinging and stuff. Y'all see the steam? It's good with the double seasoning. Mmm. Mm. Oh, who knows about that double seasoning, y'all? Them Goya products. Mm hmm. Ooh. That was very ASMR. This is a sourdough loaf. It's a roasted garlic sourdough loaf. So all you do is just put some toast and put some butter on it. It already has the garlic essence on it. So good. Yo, my face is all up in this camera. <laughs> it's a different angle. Trying something different. A different angle. Y'all let me know what you think about the last one we did compared to this one. This one is all up in my grill. All up in the grill. Mm. So this is really, really easy to make, guys. If you guys have a family and you guys want a good, hearty meal, meat and potatoes. The one I did was meat and potatoes, right? The steak and the baked potato. <coughs> mm. It's so good. Y'all saw how I put it on this plate. Like, I didn't hear use my hands and everything. Mmm. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna finish this. That adobo seasoning gives it a notch. Y'all see my bread for home? Can you have a drink? And for the drink, guys, we are having a green tea with cucumber with citrus. I haven't had these yet. <clears throat> I really like, look at that, see? Look at them. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'm mad. <laughs> You should see right here, y'all, if you can see it. Mm -mm -mm. I'll let you know what this tastes like. I smell the cucumbers right. Okay. It tastes real refreshing. It tastes like green tea with cucumbers. <laughs> That's what it tastes like. Y'all could put a little bit more cheese if y'all want. There's no cheese pull in this, as you can see. Which is fine. Some people like a lot of cheese where you get the cheese pull within the whole mix. Those things are just falling. <laughs> things are just falling. Ooh, my hands are oh. Fail. I let you didn't fall on the floor. Mm. 
bread is still there. So let me down, let me down. Let me know in the comments below, guys, what other casseroles you guys make <clears throat> for your family. Easy recipes that you kind of just dump into one pan or one Pyrex or whatever. And you just set it and forget it, kind of thing. Those are this is this is these are this is one of those dishes where you do that. I can't get the dial down. Just set it and forget it. Y'all see that cream of mushroom on top? Yeah, the reason why I didn't play it earlier and hit the start as I wanted you guys to see the layers of the the pan, the glass Pyrex. Mm -mm -mm, look at it. a couple more bites, y'all. I'm getting full, but I have to finish this, y'all. I'm really this close. <clears throat> mm -hmm. So what y'all think about the new setup? This is a different angle from the last time. You guys let me know if you like this one. Trying to find different types of angles, guys. I feel like with this angle, y'all could see my double chin. Because it's coming up this way instead of going down. But we will find the way. We will find a different way. Mm. Look at that shit. I was able to finish it. That was a big old piece, too. You can hear that crisp. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's a bomb ass bread. Rice and bread are my weaknesses, y'all. Rice and bread. If I ever decide to go keto, be a hot mess. <clears throat> For the hubs, it'll be tortillas and bread <laughs> that he'll miss. <clears throat> All right, we cleaned the plate today, y'all. Last piece. Last piece. Right. Again, I don't know if I'm releasing this before or after Thanksgiving, so if it's before Thanksgiving, hopefully you guys have a great Thanksgiving. If it was after Thanksgiving, hope you guys had an awesome Thanksgiving. <clears throat> All I know is releasing this week. <laughs> week of Thanksgiving. Sorry for the shenanigans that happened earlier. Dropping stuff, spilling stuff. I appreciate y'all being here. Excuse me. Ooh, Lord Jesus, I'm burping. Is this the no burp challenge? Oh, oh excuse me. <laughs> All right, fam. 
We'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today on this mukbang in our new studio. Um, new studio lighting, different angle. We'll keep it going and see what it's like. Check out new angles. Appreciate you guys being here. Don't, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to hit that red button below and hit that bell notification, guys, for more <clears throat> for more homemade homemade cooking, uh, more mukbangs, eating shows, and of course, let's talk about it um, for the month of November and December. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye, y'all. Bye, my two squad.